OK, now it's over to Chef Mark, who always washes his jeans regularly, don't you, Mark? Yeah. Well, actually, if you get a shot behind the desk, he clearly doesn't. Um, but anyway, what have we got today? A right. Filipino dish. This yeah. is good. A Filipino dish, beef with coconut and eggplant. Yum. So two, two dishes in, in, uh, in one meal. Nice. OK, good. Uh, really simple to do. We're going to marinate the beef. We've got soy in there. We've got a little bit of pepper, some chilli flakes, tiny pinch of uh, sugar, coconut in there. So really sort of fresh coconutty and then we've got sort of eggplant with soy and a bit of vinegar as well so you get that sharpness from the eggplant it's mm. gonna be great brilliant yeah i'm excited it sounds amazing we'll see the full recipe a little later on we are back in the beko kitchen with a delicious sounding filipino dish I'm not sure we've ever done a filipino recipe before have we mark uh, no i don't think okay, so okay well i'm That's keen everything because it's looking delicious let's see if we can make it delicious right eggplant yes so i got an eggplant just going to cut it in half yep we'll quarter it yep Right, and we need to salt it. Okay. So you, you feel the f uh, flesh, mm -hmm. so it's quite sort of pappy, and it's it's quite wet as well. So what we're going to do okay. is we're going to put it in a bowl, the yep. towel, and we're going to season it with some salt, and that's going to draw out the moisture. Okay, cool. There so you go. So it's going to take the liquid out. So you want to do that. How long for? And then you want to leave that for about half an hour, room okay. temperature, uh, and then you want to dry it off after. You know, try and get the, some of that excess salt off. Um, but it will take the moisture out of there, so when it and it will suck up all these flavours. Oh, good! You know? So you take the moisture out and Brilliant. fill it with some uh, more moisture. Okay, what's next? Right, what we need to do now is um, what do we need to do? <laughs> I can, like, I can hint your hesitation. Like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> right, we're going to get the um, we're going to get the beef marinade in. Okay, nice. So there's a lot of uh, preparation work in this dish. You know, it's a very simple dish, but what we need to do is start it early. Um, and marinate it, and then that's going to maximise the flavour. And you're trimming off of the fat? Yeah, yeah, I'm just going to take the flat, fat off. Yep. So you can do this, so this is a, a sirloin steak, what we've got. So I'm just going to take the fat off and just use the good part of the um, meat. Um, the good part. Well, no, you, know, you know what I mean. You know, because so we're, the we're just yeah. going to uh, cube it. Okay, you know, nice. you, could use, uh, you could use different cuts of meat as well. You could use okay. a, a flank. Um, that works really well. You know, it's a little bit of a cheaper cut of meat. You could use rump. Um, which is good. So pretty much whatever you've got access to, it's right. good. So, and I'm just going to dice it up so we've got some, you know, nice chunky pieces of meat. Brilliant. There, right, I'm going to put it in. You're going to make the marinade. Okay, cool. So I've got some brown sugar in there. Yep. Stir that around. I've got some soy in there. Okay. Right, you got chili. some... you got some, uh, yeah, some pepper flakes. Yeah. Some peppercorns. You want me to wait until yep. this is dissolved before? Yeah, we... dissolve yep. all the sugar first, yep. and then you can. Uh, I'll let you use your discretion to oh. put the uh, chili in. What a good man! Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> I think you've had enough of chili. But if I said to you Filipino food, what pops into your mind first of all? What sort of flavour are you tasting? Yeah, yes. Is it a coconutty? Yes, yeah, it's all coconuts. You've got those soys there. Okay, you've got, nice. You know, there's quite a few rice dishes. Um, you know. Big impact sort of flavours as well. Okay, cool. There you go. And a bit of chilli in there. Is that too much? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 that's fine. That's fine. You can do whatever you want, Mike. <laughs> and some pepper as well. So this goes in as holes? Yeah, so we're going to leave it whole. So you, so you can just put a few in there. You oh, don't have cool. to put loads in there. Okay, cool. That's quite nice, you know. They give it a really good flavour. Nice and we're going to cook it meat. in the sauce. Yep. So they'll, they'll soften slightly. Um, but we'll leave them whole, so when you actually eat the dish, if you bite on one, you know, it gets quite nice, quite peppery. But it works well with the sugar and the, um, the soy. I've got a little bit of garlic as well. And that's going in that mix yep, too? Yeah, that's going in that mix as well. This is our marinade, if you just joined us. With the uh, beef that we're going to marinate, how long are we doing that for? Yeah, so um, half an hour, sort okay, of minimum. Cool. So pop it in, half an hour if you, do, you can do that room temperature. A bit like your um, eggplant. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. So, so that's, that's what I'm saying. So just have a bit of, uh, bit of time up your sleeve before you start the recipe, so you can get maximum flavours in there okay and then once you've done this that stage you know then it's really really easy you know we can just we can just get get on with the recipe right a little sauce for the eggplant saucepan here yep we've got some more soy that goes in some vinegar okay. red wine vinegar yep and I've got some garlic just gonna slice that garlic up nice Okay, cool. I'm liking the simplicity of this, but it's yeah, going to be an explosion of taste. Yeah, it's going to be heaps of flavour in yeah. there. That goes in down there. Bring it to the boil. We're going to simmer it for about five minutes or so. or will thicken we'll slightly. It down. Yeah. And then we're going to finish our eggplant in that sauce as well. So it glazes around. It's going to be mm, tasty. Nice work. So are we doing two separate dishes? Yeah, two separate dishes. Okay, cool. And uh, obviously the most important part of the recipe, yes. <laughs> which I nearly forgot to put in, coconut. The coconut. That goes in there as well. Oh, so it goes in the marinade? Yeah. Okay, so cool. That goes all in the marinade. And then, so this is going to act as a marinade and it's going to act as a sauce as well and the vessel to cook the meat in. Brilliant. So okay, look at great. that. Fantastic. Ooh, that's looking nice, isn't it?
Yum, thank you for introducing us to some Filipino tastes. I'm really excited about this, and Brilliant. we'll get to see the next stage a little later on in the show. Right now, though, we are back in the Beko kitchen. We're making a Filipino coconut beef, and we're also doing an eggplant dish. So two dishes on the go, nice and simple, full of flavour. We've reduced down this so far, so just through the magic of television, let's pretend we've sped everything up. How's the eggplant looking? <laughs> Fantastic, and if you look closely, yes. you can see, because if we put that salt on, it's drawing out the uh, moisture of the eggplant there. Oh, yeah, you can see. You know, so it's only been a few minutes. Okay, it's hard um, to see on the tally, isn't it? But yeah, yeah but give it, I can give see it half an hour, and you will see like a, a decent amount of liquid coming out, and then just sort of dry it off. Oh, you look at that. There you go. Yeah. I see. And then sort of, you know, get get some fresh towel, dry it off, take that excess salt off because we've got soy in the dressing as well. So you don't want to make it too salty. So that's a little. Um, Thing to watch out for. Okay, so don't make it too salty. And the reason we're drawing all the moisture out is so the eggplant can then resuck all the flavoursome moisture from exactly, that dish. Okay, exactly. Cool. We can get maximum amount Big of flavour in there. Sponge. Right, uh, another pan on the st on the stove. Get yep. it nice and hot. Good amount of oil in there. So when you cook an eggplant on a in a pan, you want to get it really hot so we can get the colour in there. We can seal it in. Oh, if okay, you don't get your that. pan hot and it's yeah. just boiling, it's just going to suck all that oil into the eggplant and, and then sometimes soggy. yeah it's going to yeah. get soggy it's going to get all oily bits. it's going to be it's going to be horrible okay so get pan hot get the oil in get the oil hot pop it in you want to hear that sizzle yeah i can hear that sizzle sir and that's it and then what we're going to do is we're going to brown it on all sides you do the skin side as well yeah yeah we'll okay. get the skin side as well and we want to cook it we've quartered it so it's not going to take too long to cook probably about sort of four or five minutes you know turning it regularly you can be in charge of that mike okay nice Nice, <laughs> give me a job today. You can have a spoon. Oh, thank you, that's alright, spoon works. Right, so we've got, the, uh, we've got the sauce now for the eggplant, so the vinegar and the soy, that's reduced down. I'm just simmering it over. Alright. Oh gosh, how brown? Do no, no, we, brown? Can, yeah, no we, can, we can get a good colour on there. Okay, good. So we can get a really good uh, colour. Brown, dark brown, not black. Okay, cool. Dark okay. brown, not black. No, but you can go quite dark. And the more <laughs> good luck. The, the more caramelisation you get on this, or the more colour you get on this, um, the more flavour you're going to get out of it. Okay. So that's that's a good thing about eggplant. Right, I've got a I've got a big pan over here. Yes. Nice wok on there. So we imagine this has been like sort of half an hour. Great. Okay. And then all you sides. need to do now, you'll like this one, Mike. Pop it in and cook it. Oh, nice, easy. <laughs> we love that. That's it. You know, so all your work for the uh, beef is just getting all those flavours into the beef and marinating. So this is going to, you know, you're going to use all this liquid to cook the beef. It's going to reduce down. It's going to turn into the sauce as well. And that's just going to get heaps and heaps of flavour. You can see the eggplant there. Yeah, well, it still, still needs more, doesn't it? Way more. Yeah, yeah, still way more. But you can see, you know, that little bit of oil, what we had in the pan. Yeah. You know, it has sucked it up as well. So once you once you get you know once your pan is quite dry, yeah. you know don't be scared to just put a little bit more oil in. Okay. And it, you know just sort of keep doing that. You don't want to add too much oil over the whole process, but you can add little parts at a time. You know. Okay, cool. So there's a bit of work to do on that. And just quickly, are we going to reduce this down, or is there a set amount of time to cook? Yeah, we're going to we're going to reduce that down. Okay. So probably about half leaves you with a nice sort of thick, rich sauce. Mm. The meat's going to be cooked. By that time, the eggplant will be cooked as well. So how long do you reckon? Five, ten minutes? Fifteen? Yeah, probably about ten minutes. Ten minutes. Maybe fifteen minutes. Nice quick dish. You know? Yeah, yeah, you can get it on there. As long as it's all marinated, you know, get up early, marinate it, put it in the fridge, go to work, come home, bang, and get a really fast, tasty meal. And if you were using a different cut of beef, say you're using, you know, a flank or something? If you're going to use a flank, I would um, cook it for a bit longer. I'd cook okay. it slower and a bit longer. Nice. But if you cut it nice and thin, if you did thin strips, you know, you could probably still do it in about half an hour. Geez, the smells coming from here are incredible. It's looking fantastic. So I'll show you this. Yeah. And then, so imagine we've got a little bit more colour. Yes. And then, then you marinate, pop that over the eggplant. Oh, OK. And then that's just going to bring up to the boil. It's going <laughs> to suck all that beautiful, tasty uh, sauce in there. Nice. And glaze it as well. And there you go. Look, Look at, at that. Good. Beautiful. And that's ready to go. You know, you can leave it in strips, you can chop it up, whatever you want. Nice. And just uh, quickly, what are we going to serve this with? Uh, you could just serve it with some rice. Oh, yeah. Cool. Brilliant. Nice. You know, well, I'd whatever you want. Like this eggplant, and that sounds delicious to me. Thank you very much, Mark. I can't wait. And we will show you the end product before the time is up on the show. <laughs> okay, if you like the recipe, go to the website, thecafe.co.nz. This smells incredible. Can't wait to try it, Mark. Well, yeah, it looks great. It's come out really well. Smells insane. Okay, cool. What are you doing tomorrow? Right, tomorrow I've got a fish piccata with a sweet potato pancake. I don't even know what that is. It sounds delicious.